PS5 has already done it that many times. But it kills me. I hate when a stream goes down. Nah, you, you were just saying if you, the last time those cars were out, honestly, with the exception of the Maverick, because it wasn't even out then, was like literally testing for the very first season of Trans Am, um, and it was very quickly established that the the Mac Forty was like next to the GT Forty, the best car. Because like we were testing it, it was like the the OG testing kind of started at speedways and shit too, really. Like, originally it was kind of going to be more, like we were looking at, like, Bathurst and then just nothing but speedways. Typical bogan shit. Yeah, it takes a... Takes me a little longer to get it set up too when I'm, because like I can't do you know like I I can't do any of the thumbnail or anything like that until it's like live, or even the like the subs only mode any of that I have to wait for it to go live, go into it, click this, click that, click this, save it, go back out. Whereas like OBS, you know, I've already got it up and running. Nightbot's already talking away. I do prefer the voice of this one though, but I hate how it cuts out the um the game. Everybody loves that. The Trans Am series was an idea created by Jester because Kaz would never let us race these cars. For lovers of muscle cars, classics and two. Hey. Yeah, it goes all right. I've got the super. I've got a very good setup for the super. Actually, I haven't tried it around here myself. Well. A um, Superbird only, like Speedway races, would be fucking sick. We've had like, yeah, we had like four of us do it at Daytona and we lasted about four laps <laughs> before someone wiped out and when someone wiped out, everyone wiped out. Like it was just, but yeah, I actually quite enjoy this car, like, and I, I'm, I, I have a long and documented history with getting it to a a drivable state. I used to think this was a car like that was just undrivable. No matter where, you, like even at Daytona, going around in circles, it was undrivable. But now we have come to an agreement, and also because player he loves his Superbird, so I've you know tried to tune him up, help out. prove that it can be done especially if he's doing it on control but yeah it's, a, it's actually a really fun car 
At these new settings now, with the much heavier, it's it's a much better car. Fucking shit all over turn one. Such a fun car, bro. Like, you feel like you're driving a truck. Yeah, this is actually cruisy, man. Track limit, so yeah, I don't know what players. I mean, he has he's been added, and I guess he's been busy, but hope he gets some practice in before we start. going to need it at the new weight settings. What's going on, man? Welcome back. Please make a little more sense this time and don't be so demanding. <laughs> yeah. Um, we're streaming just via the PlayStation today, guys. So just a bit easier. Um, especially on the party, like just so I can be in the party and chill a bit. Talk to the lads. That Simon's being a snob. I want yours, please. Well, we're not doing that, mate. We're doing muscle cars. I drove the Lamborghini the other day. Already driven it, mate. Muscle cars. Fine. Simon's one looks so nice. Listening to it in the tunnel. Yeah. 100%. He's listening to it in the tunnel. See, I've never really played with it. Like, I've used the controller a bit, like drifting and shit, but I've not actually played with the sense because I don't, I've never really played these games on controller, like, not since I got a wheel four years ago. But I wish there was a sensitivity option on the wheel. Nah, just feedback. Yeah, it's... If you, like... So, like, if this was on PC, and I was using my wheel on the PC, I could change options in the wheel. 
but you can't do it on PlayStation. Like, and they don't have like the app built in. But there is like a, a Logitech G Hub, and you can like literally program the steering ratio and shit. Like, turn on turn on the wheel lock essentially. Um, but yeah, it's a. Uh, it's very limited on the consoles. Like, like on Fanatex, they can fucking adjust it on the fly, you know, like. You know, it's funny, I probably could drive that Urus at these settings. Where are you, Gangle? This is what you want? Will you... Will you go get me more subs, Gangle? I'll pull out the Lamborghini and go crash into someone. You go get all your boys to sub to me. This is for you, Gangle. I'm gonna turn it down so I can get in. Beautiful. All right, done. It's in. Let's go. Lamborghini Urus. This is for Gangle. Don't say I don't do nothing for you, Gangle boy. Listen to it. Beautiful car. Beautiful car. Do some drifts. Sick donuts. Gangle, you like that? Oh, look at it go. I oh, know so many mums who want this car. So they can take their 18 kids to soccer. Make you happy, Gangle. Look, man, Lamborghini. You're not saying nothing, Gangle. Come back. Shoots fire like a motherfucker. Yeah, it shoots fire like a motherfucker. Boy, safety car. I just want to see the fire. Whoop, whoop. as soon as I turned the talk up. Jesus Christ. Fucking awesome power shit. Hang on. Other side of the track. Oh, my God. It's got full aero damage. I'm driving it at like ninety torque to the rear. <laughs>
Whoa! <laughs> the charger. Whoa! Yeah, same. Yeah, I, did. I think he clearly did, because he'd be enjoying this if he was watching. Oh, it's so good. <laughs> All right. For some other... Yeah, I loved it. I actually had an idea, and I've got the settings kind of saved too for a safety car series. Like just for just, I wanted to do just even not series safety car race at night anywhere, just for the footage, because there's like six of them out there, and tuned to like six seventy pp on the softs. The shit, the only one that'd be shit, and it's still a rocket. I've used it is the Megan. But like the Charger, the BMW, the Skyline, and one more all match up against each other perfect. Oh, the the Le the Lexus. It's fun, bro. It's fun. Yeah, it's fun. It would it would it would actually really suit these. Like if you so like if you were in that and then everybody else is like in the muscle cars, it would really suit this scene. You can make um. So, like, if you had that and, uh, <laughs> fuck the police. <laughs> um, if you had that and Ash had his uh, Toretto charger, bro, and you were, like, chasing him, imagine the footage. Because it does look sick, like, just watching you fly along the highway. And the lighting, bro, the lighting's so good from the sirens and shit. There you go. So even this random German just joined his CC rank and he's actually jumped in the Challenger RT. So I mean, man, like some people are fucking, they can read. Like I used to do it. I used to scroll through the lobbies looking for something to join until I just started making it myself. Oh, joking's on. Come slap joking. That's why I even sometimes, like, if Simon and that, if they start fucking around too much and, like, new people join, I'm like, all right, stop, fuck. Well, people are going to think we're fucking around. Like, <laughs> well,
did you say that he was <laughs> he was floating through the canyon oh whoa all right all right enough Whereas Amiga calls him jockin'. You've got to be jockin'. Yes, uh, and this one I actually seen, like I got a notification for it, some Call of Duty player. Um, almost Codman. Hello, my name is Safi Yunad, and I am Codman competitive player. My IGN is almost. Thanks, almost Cod. Congrats on 500, bro. Happy for you. Not sure how long I'll last. I'm a big prick ATM, so if I go missing, I'll be driving the port. That's not good, bro. What's wrong? But yeah, I appreciate it, mate. You've helped. Um, yeah, what's up? You food bug or get on the piss too much? Or you got the man flu? Did you go get whatever Ferb's had? He's been very sick. He's had too many kids already joking too. It's probably already fallen off with the whole syphilis thing, you know. He's got like 18 girls, you know. He probably hacked it off himself a few years ago, to be honest. Enough of that shit. The, um, the Nova goes all right, joking. I was just really struggling in the um, the last term with it. You're missing out, hey, if he. I ate dairy when I was on the piss, and I'm lactose intolerant these days. Pretty much feels like I poison my body. Zero energy. Oh, it's, yeah. That's probably like, I mean, I already have too many dairy products as it is. That's probably one of the reasons I don't drink it all myself too, mate. It fucks with my guts. Hardcore. It's tough one, bro. Yeah, I'm pretty much the same, joking. Alright, I'll, um... What have I got to set to? Six afternoon. Blinded by light, yep. It's actually like brutal if you've been doing a like night race and you're sitting there in the dark and then you do it. I've seen it in the streams, like my reflection just lights up like a nuclear blast. Like fucking The Simpsons, Bart in the middle of the night with the TV. Alright. 
Yeah, we've had uh, Duke. Surprisingly enough, Duke. Lol. <laughs> Bo Duke is his name. <laughs> um, he showed up in one last season. Uh, and before that, I think that, yeah, there's been a few of them. Modified ones too. They st I remember when Valos last showed up in one. He was like, they took my damn flag. <laughs> That's the general with no flag on the roof. <laughs> oh. It's still uh, the remake, man. I don't care how bad a movie it is. It still cracks me up, and it's a guilty pleasure of mine. I drive into Atlanta, and they're like, why, the f why does everyone look so angry at us? But they're, just, they're just so dumb. Like, they're just so innocent and dumb. But, yeah, it's it's like a, a good, serious moment in a dumb, funny movie um, that kind of takes the piss. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's very good. And just the, the roundabout scene is incredible. And then the, the final credits of the movie where they show all the cars that they wrecked, man. Like, some of the best footage I've ever seen in my life. Like, I love that shit in movies. But yeah, really, really, really dumb, fun movie. They do, yeah. They, you put a, um, like, have them deliberately set up for it, like change the weight balance a bit, lift the height, and and then fuck with the brake balance and then just put a steering adapter in them, a pair of mediums on them, and they'll, they'll, like, they'll get your emissions warnings, you know. There's quite a few lurkers around tonight. Oh, we went 502. Hey. Alright. But yeah, I hope this um I mean Watkins I like either way, but I'm 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 keen to see what happens with race C tomorrow, Watkins Glade. All right, so all three tyres. This is the only one we haven't actually done the race distance for yet. Short shift, short shift, short shift. What time is you on?
It'll be a quick pit stop too. One of the fucking only ones we do where it is a super quick pit stop. In and out. <laughs> Not this imaginary 35 seconds driving down a pit straight that's 200 metres long. Um, probably not at the moment. He said he's not feeling well, so probably not. But I de he's he's one of those ones who like can barely do it without it now, man. So yeah, he probably is. Say no to pancake mode. That's what they say. They call it pancake mode now. What we do. Can I yeah, absolutely, man. It's an open lobby. It's not private lobby or anything. Don't have to have me at it or whatever. Um, it's muscle car series. Um, if you want to know about regulations to get in, I have a video in my video section, Trans Am trailer. Uh, but basically, there's a if you've got cars, muscle cars that are fully done up with all the weight reductions and that, they won't be able to enter. Well, it's not friends only, man. Grand Valley South. It's on public. We've had some randoms in. But yeah, if you can't get a car in, the GTO and the Corvette Stingray are currently on. It once in Haggerty's and once in the used cars, and they. Like, if you get them and do them up without the weight reduction, you'll be able to enter them because we have a heavy weight reduction. It's a part of the balance of power we've created for the series. This is just practice. We're just playing around. God, these two cars are so competitive with each other. That's good stuff, mate. Good stuff. I'm in Melbourne, bro. So is the guy in front of me, Ebolk. But we're all over the place. Other Top Gun dudes are from Sydney. Ferbs, Ferbs and Jokin of Queensland. Oh, sorry, Jokins, New South Wales. Ferbs is Queensland. We're all East Coast, though. Except Lansy. He's in the middle, in the desert. Did you watch one friend? F1, uh, the Australian race. Yeah, of course, man. It was a good race. Um, massive, massive Carlos Sainz fan. Um, and before the race, I actually said, like, I put, like, put a poll up here on the channel had four things of like a best case scenario for a poll one of them Max Verstappen crashes the second one Carlos Sainz wins the third one Lando Norris wins and or Oscar Piastri on the podium and then I can't remember what I put on the fourth but I got like two of those three things correct and Lando got on the podium did you go see no, no, I didn't. I didn't go, bro. I couldn't afford it. Um, and it was a sellout too, like a legitimate sellout. They they weren't selling any more tickets, anyways. Even if I could afford it, um, I barely had friends who were lucky enough to get tickets. It was a sellout every single day. They broke a like broke the record attendance record. I think maybe even an attendance record around the world. It was over four hundred thousand for four days. Like, even on the Thursday, they had over 100,000 there, which is just stupid. But I have been before. Not for a few years. 
Yeah, it's it's mm -hmm. good race. <laughs> yeah, it's good fun race. And I'm, I'm gutted for Carlos. Like, he's still going to... I've been talking about it a lot. He's going to end up in a lesser seat next year, and he totally doesn't deserve it. Even if he ends up with, like, the Audi Works team and they, you know, eventually turn into a... It's, he just doesn't deserve it. He's, he's... He's killed it over the last few years with, like, every team he's ever been at. He's always played second fiddle. Yeah, I know, he's, I know, especially with his choking Does habit. Not get car seems hard to drive? It is very hard to drive, um, but we've been doing this a long time. And it gets a little boring when there's only four of us here, but this is practice, man. Like, when we do the actual series, there'll be, you know, 10 to 16 of us here, and there'll be a lot of us in a party, and we'll all be laughing and talking shit, and... We start the series uh, in six days, next Saturday. So just, we're just practicing. We're testing the, all the cars that are available under different race situations. It's just, yeah, it's Sunday, Sunday night, Easter long weekend, nothing else to do. But yeah, sorry for bores you, man. It's one of the things that I do, though. I, I can't just do the usual dailies and shit. And, How long are the races? Um, so all the sprint races are 30 to 40 minute long. And there is two endurance races. One will be an hour long, one will be two hours long. Five rounds every weekend over the next five weekends. But yeah, the cars aren't easy to drive, and they're heavy, and they've got over 700 horsepower. Uh, but that's why we like it. It's I'm not easy. Hours next nice. What's that? On iRacing? racing? Or you're actually doing one in Grand Turismo? I have seen some people do 24-hour races in Grand Turismo, and I don't know, like, do they do it in stages? Would you do a whole like you can't? I just don't know how it works on Gran Turismo. It's not like you can save progress or anything like. And we all know what it like. You set up a GTWS. Oh, nice. Well, so what's that for? Like, what a like a private league thing. I don't. I don't know people who do races. Yeah, mad. That's cool. That's cool, man. We got mates who do it on ACC, and the longest I've done here has been three hours. I've been involved in a couple of three-hour races, like with Chopper Getty and them. But that was... Oh, yeah, cool, yeah. Yeah, so I'll be like top split thing. So, yeah, like when Chopper was doing it. Mm -hmm. Oh, bro, ACC. Yo, dude, the one... <laughs> that's hilarious that you say that, too. The one... The one place that I legitimately did, like, uh, the career-length enduro race at in ACC was Monza. Um, and I made a video out of it and all to uh, Tiesto uh, in Search of Sunrise because it was the it, night into morning, like, 12-hour thing. Um, and I'd never raced around Monza, like, in a night setting, and I just thought it was stunning. Like, I, it blew my mind. Uh, it depends which ones. But I don't, I, I don't know. I don't know. It's hard for me to even judge what a troll is anymore because there's just so many people that are creating accounts just to come in and kind of take the piss, but I don't know, man. Like, I... I 
I hit the 500 and then lost sub straight away. That's always kind of... Uh, no, I don't think so. But I've seen he's renamed his account. It's something else now. I've seen him in because it was in... He was in Metas. It's the exact same account, though. Just click on it and it's got all the fucking same videos. But no, I just don't, I don't care. It doesn't worry me. I don't get it. I don't get any troll. But it comes with it. I have the personality that will always bring them. And then any, any channel that gets momentum is always going to bring it. Of course, you bring more people in, it opens up the chances. Anybody who streams full stop, if they're not a robot, devoid of emotion, they are opening themselves up to be trolled. And I know I have a personality that some people don't like, and that's fine. It's completely understandable, but I'm pretty upfront about it too. Like, But yeah, I don't know, man. Whoever they are, like, like I said, I didn't even know who they were when they first showed up here. Maxi pointed them out and said outright, this person is not good. Get rid of them. And I humoured it at first, but like my my first interaction with them was someone else telling me that they had been in Keys stream before they showed up here. So that alone, I'm like, I don't, I don't know if they know me or they want to know me or like, but I don't care. Like that anybody who puts that much effort, it's just, it's too much. Like it's, I, I just even the process fucking, I hate, I hate having like two different email accounts. The process of like signing into a new email every time I'd be like, fuck's sake, what's my password? What's this fucking stupid troll account named? I hate Jester 2. I hate Arnie 1. He's, he's, he's funny. I'll give him credit. Yeah, it's hard when you get distracted here, bro. Person so please waving, face green smiling. No, this is Jester. How long ago was this? Oh, no, nah, well, yeah, no, nah, it wouldn't have been me. Because I haven't, no, no, I do have another account called No, This Is Jester. But I haven't used it on Gran Turismo in over a year. Yeah. Not that, Jester. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's hilarious. Yeah, yeah, that's, yeah, gold. Cool. I have seen some about, and I imagine that it's probably a troll account. Um, but there are other jesters too. Like I remember even going back years. Like, hello. Oh, wolf, nice. Um, yeah, I, I think I've seen Kiwi jesters too. There's Americans, like, like the Josh thing, bro. We've had Highlander moments, you know. It can only be one. <laughs> and even Meta used to be like, yeah, but your name is no. This is Jester, like with the OG account. It's like, so no matter what anybody's name is, your name is like the comeback every time. But yeah, it's all, it's fucking Spongebob. Patrick? No, this is Patrick. Yeah, it's Trans Am at the moment, sorry. If you're not interested in that. Oh, it's Timmy. Yeah, we're doing Trans Am, bro. Um, hey. Yeah, so now someone's doing it with you too, bro. Look at the chat. Look at the chat right now. Yeah, it's so obvious every time. Like, it's just, this is the type of shit I mean. 
now makes me even susceptible of the first person I was talking to, you know what I mean? Like straight up, that's their tactic, they just, it's pathetic, whoever you are man, and it makes me susceptible of even the first, like I said, even the first person now, you can have a normal conversation and then it's like something gets mentioned, bang, person's, like it just makes everything sus, fucking sick of it, can't see to get a life. Go dedicate a channel to me and just fucking edit content and turn me into a fucking key guys, CRT, etc. Just just go turn me into one of them. Just go turn me into one of them, mate. Yeah, I know. That's the tactic. Yeah, it's whoever they are. They they've got a hard on for me. Like they've got that much of a hard on. They're sucking their own cock for me every night. The amount of effort they're going to to assume the identities of so many people. And like it's not even yeah, it's not even funny. And like, it's like the same, like turn TC off, the same, I've seen him in Meta's thing, giving Meta shit about the system, like Meta's. Nah, nobody's joining TPGN ever again. Top Gun is done. Top Gun is like three people. And that's the way it'll stay. Yeah, I know, it's, it's... Are you, do you understand gaslighting, Josh? Like, literal textbook, de textbook definition of gaslighting? Look it up. Look it up, like, in terms of, like, even in a... Yeah, it's textbook definition. But that's exactly what it is and what it has been for about a month now. And like you've seen me the whole time too, I've been like, I've been pretty fucking chill and pretty good with shit. Um, and I am known for being way, 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 way worse and more off tap and unfiltered and etc. Um, no, I, I don't know of them personally. Um, they subbed, I think they subbed to my channel a little while ago. I see them in, uh, I think Papa's chat. Papa's chat maybe, Brigsby's, one of them. I don't know. I don't know who they are. I don't know who many YouTubers are, man, besides the big ones and besides my mates. Yankee Lola. Yeah, I'm happy that you're more children happy. No, oh, it's all a front, Ming. The mask, the face paint, the clown paint. I've always known what it takes, though. But I'm saying in terms of this troll stuff, at least even, like coming at me when I'm going off is, is going to get more out of whatever they're after. And I haven't been. Like I've been devoid of it and just shutting it down because I'm, I'm not going to feed them. And it still just keeps coming, keep coming, keep coming, keep coming. And, and the channel's just been growing and growing and growing. So it's, it's, it is amusing.
Mate, well, yeah, but were you sitting outside of it, though? It'd be, it'd be a lighting glitch, bro. The lighting glitch. Because, like, you know how the way it does, like, even sometimes, like, it gives you that blinding les lens flare every time you drive in and out of tunnels? It'd be an effect. Like, it's probably just that the, the effect is programmed so hard every time a car goes in and out of it that it effectively did disappear from your sight. Like, yeah, it'd be an effect, 100%. Which is funny. Um, they took their softs really far. I wouldn't have even thought of that, but I guess it's just the front left that's getting destroyed. Well, go talk to Meta about it, mate. It's not my problem. I'm not his fucking boss. In daily I've never even, I haven't seen E-Bulk do a fucking daily in years, bro. But why don't, why don't you go message Meta and be like, your teammate's a dirty cunt. God, that echo, I couldn't even hear my own horn. Right home. Is he uh, I don't think so. He was before. Doing Yeah old spa. Yeah, he was on for a bit. Killing it. Doing his thing. Spa to him is what Monza is to me. Bro, I'm doing whatever the fuck I want. If you don't shut up, like I've humoured you, you were having a normal conversation and then you just like, in a heartbeat, just like being a fuckhead. And you know it. Like who goes into people's streams and tells them what to do when they're clearly doing something? Who, you know, like who tells them turn off something, do something different, why do you do, like, what's your, what's your, what's your goal? You want to go watch Spa? Go find someone who's streaming Spa, bro. Go find someone who's streaming Spa. Go to, go live now on Gran Turismo, you'll find a million people streaming it. I'm just asking you. No, you said go. Call me you very clearly commanded. You very clearly said turn off TC. You're very clearly the same person that's been going into everybody's chat and acting like you're the king fucking shit and that anything that they do or say just isn't good enough. Whoever you are, you're a sad cunt. Like, you're a sad cunt. Even another channel just started hey Jester. Yeah, no shit. I'm racing, bro. I don't have time to look at all this shit, but I'm here, right? Oh, I'm having Jester? normal, normal conversations. Yes. Was, was, was the whole time. Same person, whoever it is. They tried bringing up, like they're trying to get themselves talked about. That was the start of the conversation. That was the start of the conversation. They're trying to get themselves talked about. The very troll. No, he's already done that. It was uh, Ming 8 gear. And then it was Meta 8 gear. And Simon, it's, yeah, it's just non-stop. 
whoever they are. The accounts they have started just today is ridiculous. Uh, is what it is. You're hiding in the dark. What would you like to see more of from Chester? Feel free to suggest new things, what you should do more of and also less of. Who's your favorite ninja turtle? Jester's is Raphael. Dolores's is Leonardo. Yeah, like a demon head. It's more like a devil, though. But yeah, it's cool. I I was worried I went a bit too arty with it, like a bit too hot rod. I love the dodge on the front, the the grill placement. I love the way you're able to to put the riding on the front of the car. I'm falling in love with it. Honestly, you should. I probably still got the live stream of like the first time I drove it. I was cursing it out so much, like just saying it was a piece of shit. All it was good for was drifting, going sideways, that it had no top speed, just drinks its fuel. I was like, they've ruined the because the Charger was a pretty solid car on its own, and then, and like even the Demon, I didn't like the Demon so much. Good drift car. But like I prefer the Hellcat. I think the, Hell, the Hellcat's faster, easier to drive, looks better, etc. And then yeah, this this swap. At first, I was like, they've ruined it. Like I was like, don't put it in your charger. It's fucking horrible. It guts your car, drinks your fuel. I can't remember what track I even like finally got it working at because like I was surprised at Daytona. It couldn't get more top speed. Just the sound of it alone, like GTO too. The GTO was one where like the sound of it alone just made me want to drive the car. But this thing, it's 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 it sounds possessed. Like it sounds full blown evil, demonic, possessed. Like it's playing a villain in a movie. Oh shit! I've been paying attention to my fuel. I've been going way too hard. And yeah, I spent way too long on the um, meds. But now I know. I can run out of fuel too. Hey <laughs> oh, it's been pretty productive. Done some grinding, done a shitload of lobbies. Um, update was so so, very average, but that GT1 is all three cars actually are exceptional. Um, I've already used both the road cars in the Le Mans grind. I've used the GT1 for the Sardinia grind. I've done, I've raced the GT1 in more places under group two settings than what I have like anything group three recently. Um, pushed forward with the subs. It's really fun. It's really, really fun. Like untuned, no bop, it's, it's off its head. Like, and then tuned even like I've already got an idea, bro, of doing, um, I was talking about it today, uh, Group C and 
those three Group 2 cars, the CLK, the McLaren, and um, the GT1 in a, like, Group 1, Group 2, multi-tiered endurance race. They'd be way better, way better than doing Group 1, Group 3. And just specifically those cars, like Group C, I think it'd be cool. But yeah, it's been alright. We've had trolls coming left, right, and centre, bro. Your mate, the one that's reckons he's your brother. Um, non-stop attack of the trolls, but we're dealing with it really well. Hit the 500. Got shorts that are going mental in their views. Yeah, it seems like. Um, it seems like something that, um... Just ignore them, bro. But yeah, it's not, it's non-stop, Caleb. It's non-stop. Like, I mean, it's like... Well, we're, we're nearing maybe 20 accounts in a month from the same person non-stop <clears throat> are you doing that um oh he was talking shit yeah never mind Mad fun. At least it helps her sub down. Yeah, but then they just all unsub and it's been going up and down like a yo-yo too. It gives them an ability as a troll to like, you know, take away that power. No worries, bro. All good. No stress, man. That's what I mean. Too long on minutes. Oh, that too. Yeah, oh, fucking A. Uh -huh. oh, no worries, bro. Yeah, nah, no, all good, bro. That's what I said. No, that's right. All right, have a good night, bro. I'll speak to you tomorrow. It's all normal today because I'm not using OBS. Oi. What's going on? Oh. Yeah. What's that coming through? Yeah. Is that, oh, is that the stream? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't fucking see the um, keyboard and type messages on it. I'm echoing bad. In, some, in my feed, you mean? Probably. I think it's because of how like, I had to, I've always got to balance it out, you know, people different. Different, yeah, everyone's different. He's, he's just low, but yeah, probably because I got the party turned up too loud now, and this headset, it picks up, like, the earpiece. Fuck, takes up concentration. Here's another one. Yeah, I know who they are, mate. It's it's non-stop, Josh. Just uh, and don't even no timeouts. Like I said, just remove, remove, remove. Don't do it immediately. I pretty much know who who it is or can tell straight away. Yeah, it's one. that one I've seen before too. And they had different spelling last time. Last time it had Arnie. This time it's Arnie. It's non-stop. 
it's not stop. It's just whoever they are, they've got the saddest existence. Like, they really do. You got to admire the game. It's not stop. Yeah, mute stream, bro. Ah, but yeah, it's non-stop. Hey, pig. Oh, yeah. yeah it, looks, know, it looks really good, the pig. Oh, I like it. The more I keep looking at it, the more I think it looks really, really nice. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> are we Oh, I would. I'd be keen to do it again, yeah, because I... Um, had a lot of shit happening. Uh, no, no, not. Bro, like, it's it was just a bullshit. They've done it heaps. Like, they've pretended to be, like I said, they've pretended to be other people before. They see... They pretend to be people in the chat. They pretend to be people that you've raced with. Like, it's... But, yeah, they said that you were their brother. They were saying that, you, that they were racing... To, like, does your brother play the game? They said that they were racing with you in the mods of races that, like, I did the edits with... Yeah, it's just, they, they talk shit. It's the same, per like I said, it was the same tactic that someone had fucking, it matter of remember this, with the Taz Racer thing. It's just, yeah, they said that you were, like, they were talking, but now I'm sick of talking about them. So please, Caleb, don't feed the, because, like, that's literally what the person was just doing before. They brought it up, they tried playing a normal conversation, brought it up, played it off, and then they started with the troll straight away, like. But it's, yeah, they, that was their story. You could go back, I've got live chat replay on all my streams, bro. Um, I couldn't remember what stream it was, but yeah, it's, it's, it's been nonstop. It's just absolute cocksucker, whoever it is. Their own mother probably thinks they're a piece of shit. But it's the name of the game. That part I understand. It's it's YouTube. It's social media, but it's YouTube. It's like as long as YouTube's been around and people are able to get you know traction or get a, a following or a platform or whatever. People that are going to attack, hate, bring it down, are going to exist. That's just that's what they do. There are people who get excited. It's sad and pathetic they get excited by doing stuff like that, isn't it? And that just... But yeah, they don't care. They love even hearing this, like the... The condescending, mocking, like being scolded and shit. They love it. They're probably like, yeah, they're probably legit someone who would like fucking put water behind their mother when she's washing the dishes to watch her fall over and, and get yelled at. You know what I mean? Like they're probably just that type of person that that's how much they like the attention. Like they just, it's all a game until it's up. And then when the game's up, they can, they can be hateful and horrible and just come back and, and do the charade all over again. Um, I must say, even the hearts felt, like, semi-okay at the start. I know, I didn't know, Simon, like, what tyres you got on after the pit, either. So, at first, I was like, oh, fuck, he's flying. And I nearly ran out of fuel at the end, too. Um, what do you think, Timmy, of a, a cross um, group 
Enduro, Le Mans, um, the Group C cars, and then the, the three um, 99, 2000 era Group 2 cars, um, CLK, McLaren, GT1. Oh, do they match up pretty well, do they? Oh, fuck it. A, they do. Um, oh, the, yeah. the, we already know how fast the CLK is. Um, yeah, yeah, the yeah. McLaren, I can't speak for personally, but Simon was driving it a bit, and um, I know Dom was doing really well in his one too. But the GT1 is... It's like it reminded me of the um, the the TSO fifty one, the hybrid Toyota. How like yep. that that thing's like thirty kilometres an hour faster than the other one in in a straight line. It reminded me of that a bit. Like when you get in the draft in it, especially. Um, so at a place like Le Mans, oh, so they're only going to lose the Group One cars at like the three twenty three thirty mark, and then those Group One cars, Group C cars, more specifically, like. You know, they're, they're the only ones that can go past that mark as it is. Um, so if you had, like, a full field committed to it, have, I reckon, six Group Cs and then ten of the other. Rather than eight and eight, have, like... But you could do eight and eight or you do six ten. I reckon six ten would be better. But it, I, I think as a, as a competition point of view, like, oh, I think there could still be a chance of those Group 2 cars competing with, especially if it rained or something. Because um, the Group C cars are, the, the Group C cars are all um, 10 years older. Yeah, the, the Group 2 ones are more... They do, yeah. Um, but I think it'd be... It'd be much more competitive and fun and tight, uh, tight-knit than to say, you know, when people do Group 1, Group 3. Um, and even over the course of a one hour or two hour, I think the chances of getting lapped at a place like Le Mans in cars like those would be highly low. Like, you know, unless you had a catastrophic race. Like, um, I think that the Group 2 cars, these new ones, could stay on the lead lap. They go about, like, I was doing, like, just over 330s, 333s, stuff like that, and I wasn't getting a perfect lap. But there were dudes that were already doing, like, 329s and shit. And then the, the Group C cars, they're doing, like, 320 in race so 10 seconds a lap fucking three and a half minute lap 35 laps before they even lap them and that's if everything goes perfect same got a beautiful flow to it I'll be back in two minutes and we'll go. Cool. All three tires again? Yep. Yes.
Balls deep into livery editing, and it's 50 minutes later, he's still not here. Jesus Christ. Wonder if he's a fucking artsy. Wonder if he's a one finger typer. Well, if he's still doing a livery, I'd say yes. <laughs> Some acceleration on it. That thing? Yeah. Yeah. God, I wish we could do drags. Even that, that new Audi, I was playing around with that, fully done up. He uh, did it, I uh, entered it up against like the Valkyrie and Enzo and shit like that, one of the hyper races, and oh, the acceleration on it. I was like, I want to drag this thing. All right, mediums or softs? Meds, meds. I'm going meds and just try to do a shorter stint this time. I, I went to like, I, I went to like fucking lap 17 last time, I think. Yeah, I'm going to lap 10. Nice. That's the Joker. It's because I've got Joker outfit on. Look at the car. It's my demon. And yeah, I just wasn't um, focused, concentrated enough, talking shit with trolls, and um, wasn't really putting the foot down much. And then when I was, I forgot about short shifting, I was just pushing too hard.
We got partner, partner. <laughs> Joe's right here. Well, he's always been there. <laughs> It's all right. I'm, it's a pretty cruisy. <laughs> it's a pretty cruisy pace, man. I'm doing a lot of short shifting. Still trying to maximise on fuel and use it for the soft thing. Fucking hell. Yeah, I don't know how I've managed to avoid one, bro. But I don't know how you feel. Because, yeah, you're probably just following the exact same line as me. Feels like it. Yeah, it does.
And we're going to burn more too, yeah. which is what I did in the last one, so be careful. a penalty or something, Simon? No. Why are you so far behind? I pitted. Yeah. I would have thought you would have come out pretty much in front of me or right on me.
in like an outlet. 58 and 14. Uh, 283. Yeah, because you had to grab more fuel. I went in later. A lap later. Two litres a second, five seconds. A leader? Fucking Americans. Gallon. <laughs> so is this the old days? What do we do with a drunken sailor? What do we do with a drunken sailor? What do we do with a drunken sailor early in the morning? I'm sorry, someone said pirates. Timmy's like, oh, I know that one. That was, that was in my youth. I was actually trying to think of this. Hello, ladies. Salvatus. <laughs> Last game, Wolf, to, to come back in between races. this car. Uh, the charger with the demon and engine swap. Like the charger was already sick, but 
once you get this demon figured out gearing wise and how to maximise on its fuel and shit. It's, it's just the sound of it. Nothing sounds like it. Used to say the same about the GTO and now this thing makes the GTO sound quiet. Like fucking last race, Jay. J-Dog was sitting in the tunnel beeping at us every time we went past and I swear I couldn't I couldn't hear his horn. Like I could just hear the car screaming. I love seeing the colour of the sky in this place around this time. So many different colours out in that skyline. Fucking steal my best lap, cunt, with a set of fresh tyres and more tanking. Fuck. Shit, cunt. Ah, oh, but he ran off the track and the tyres was fucking shot. So I'll try, I doubt it. Ten nine. It would be um, a good strategy in a race if you. Because the pit is very quick in and out if you're just grabbing tyres. No, no, if you, right if you could sacrifice the position and you wanted the extra point for the lap, it would be worth the cheeky drop back, lose the position on purpose, just to steal someone's thunder. Yeah, I'm sure Ash and Tito will show up for this one and just be like, fuck it. One minute eight. Boom. <laughs> uh, I'm just coming into turn one. settings on them. Yeah, they feel fucked without settings on. 
too loose. Not grippy enough. The uh, timing was immaculate, absolutely immaculate. This track and sunset, wow. Yeah, it is, isn't it? Isn't it? I know, Lancey. I think we we could all be prone to a, a crash or two in this stage of the fight, uh, race by just going, woo! Chama charm. Left, left. Listen to it, Jimmy. Listen, 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 listen. <laughs> yeah, that's bad. You hear, I swear, you hear it more. Like, even in replay, you hear it more when you're outside the car than when you're in it. Like when it goes past or when you're in third person. Yeah, my front left is pretty fucked. Welcome to Trans Am. You're officially a man now. The fact that you're still driving around on your rim. I'm serious. You think about it like in, in the Group 3 cars, check it, you're dead, bro, like at that point, with the exception of Daytona. Like, you're dead at that point. You're going to spin off the face of the earth, you know, <laughs> like, these things, like, you, especially the weight, you just keep going. And just know that whatever tyre's cooked to turn in the opposite direction is going to suck. <laughs> You push him away from me. Well, he's in first, isn't he? He's winning. <laughs> I'm fucking. I thought I was fucking around with him, thinking he was yeah, and then I let him pass. He's been bleeding time to me since I've hit him. Oh, I'm just just gonna come short. Just didn't push hard enough in the middle stint there. I didn't have to slow down at least like I did last race. Good on him. In the Nova, mate. Oh, in the boss now. <laughs> I thought he was still in the Nova. <laughs> Lol. Final boss. So he just did an epic fuel save on it.
You got close on the lap. No, I had that before. Ah, I pitted. No, mate. Ice Boogie. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm liking how um how even these two feel though, the Charger and the Challenger. Like when they're around each other, you know? Yeah. Like mine's got a strength, yours has got a strength, but it's it's really cool. Like they, they almost like the two different cars but when we're racing around each other anyways, I feel like like even when you're fucking around, like I feel like there's at least still like a we can work around it. Like I kind of fully know what your car is going to do, I feel, like, very comfortable. Yeah, I, just, I just needed you to fuck up once going in with that slow left-hander after the S's and it would have been right. I was, um, I was hesitant with the downhill bit to start with, and then, um, he's trying to jump on my balls, man. Stretch. Yeah, per and big turn very on him. Oh man, I can hear that. <laughs> <laughs> He's got a big purr on him. Is that the black and white one? Yeah. Yeah. Even my neighbor my neighbour met him the other day and neighbour had only met the um the the bitch. And he was like, oh, she bit me. And then he made, he made this one. Like, I literally, I was like, oh, you want to meet the other one? And I've just walked in. So I grabbed him, walked back out. And straight away, as soon as he's seen him, like, you know, this dad, he's like, oh, look at the size of him. I'm like, yeah, he, he, he's a good cat. And then straight away, like, scruff on the head. And Vlad's like, oh, yeah. He's like, oh, I like him. I like him. I'm like, like, of course you do. Every bloke does, like, his fucking dog cat. Yeah, big, big fatty. Loves, loves a scratch. He is a friendly cat. He's got a fucking. St he loves his chair, though, Timmy. He's obsessed with it. Rubs his face all over it, and then as soon as I get out of it, he fucking in like he, he, he'll be curled up in the ball, dead to the world. And as soon as I get up, go have a smoke, go to the toilet, I come back in, he's sitting in the fucking chair. I'm like, get out. Well, it's a comfy chair. It's a real comfy. I think the ultimate ones would be like, um, like the Daytona style. Reclining chair. Like, not reclining, but like a, a movable chair, you know, on a rail or whatever. Um, this thing could be rigged up. Like if you customise this, you could rig it up. Like you, you just need a few, you know, bits and pieces. So track or not? Anyone? Yeah. Uh, Le Mans Tokyo, really. They're the only other two. Like would be the choice of. Probably more Tokyo. We've done less Tokyo than anything else. Oh, Tokyo would be cool. right. And I'll make it half hour. Because it's a one hour race. Um, and I think it's all, it's only hard medium. So yeah, I'll keep it on that. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Beautiful. Hadn't seen. 
Ooh, yes, it does. In which tire did you say? Medium hard. It's inspired by the Tokyo 600, and the tire, and it's got the highest tire wear of any race that we do, like astronomically higher. Are you allowed to use them? Uh, no, I don't even think I've got them available. I might still have them available, I don't know. Yes, they're available. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, yeah. You can't see the advantage of putting on an extra set of hard the, the proper race will be a one hour race. So it's something to think about for that. But You needed to keep the soft soap for the PP and the horse power. The tyre wear is X12. Like, so previous race was X7. And you've seen what it did to the softs in that, so. And the actual race of this will be one hour, medium hard required, with rain. Heavy damage? Yeah, always. And wall penalty? No. No, not, not unless it becomes an issue throughout the weeks, you know, leading up to it. Um, I mean, if we don't have it on the speedway, having it on here would be chaos, you know what I mean? Like, it's, it'd be like having the same as Bathurst. We've never turned it on at Bathurst, and Bathurst is another one, you know what I mean? Like, it's, yeah, yeah, yeah. there's already, the heavy damage is already, like, yeah. you know what I mean? You hit the wall, <laughs> you're fucking, you're broken, like 200k an hour plus, and your car's broken, so... Um, but yeah, well, it's something we've definitely debated and pro and conned about before. But it's it's more like so like when we were doing the um, the fun group two lobbies the other day, and we ended up at a oh, high speed ring. They were doing it. Someone was accused of doing it, and then so I was like, all right, straight away. And I went to Tokyo and I put wall pants on, and then very quickly, like because I didn't tell anyone I'd done it to, just very quickly, like it was like, all right, yeah, now we're properly racing. You know what I mean? But then there was also cunts getting pushed into the wall and getting the pen. So, yeah. Yeah. And you hang it out sideways. Pen. Yeah. I like this, Bert. I ain't, I've hardly ever raced it before. And then I did a Sunday night race a couple of months back and thinking it was really nice. He will. Um, I've got to go take a piss, and he's looking at me right now. Like, go, mate. Go on. Go. You'll be right. I'll wash your chair for you.
I'll be back in a couple of minutes. What is, what is this, this random weather? weather? It's got some rain in the middle. He tried, mate. I uh, put the fucking, like the moment I popped up, he tried, but I put the stool that I have next to me using as a mouse stand on it, and he looks, he's looking at me so pissed off now, like broken hearted. Little shit. Alright. We got Camaro, Camaro. Two minutes, just give me two minutes, Draken, to quickly um quickly check that this thing is drivable not required And X13 tire. Yeah, that'll do. Feels alright. No worries, bro. Fucking one more is one more. Well, the best bit is we play. Waving hand, waving hand. I think I've seen 322.
Oh, beautiful, beautiful. Oh, if I hadn't, I'd have ended up hitting the outside wall. Your car should dominate here, Timmy. Your car should dominate with fucking Lance Stroll driving it, Timmy. It's going to be a huge problem for me. She's fucking quick at a straight line, right? Yeah. yeah, but it can only drive straight. Distribution's horrible. The one piece is real. The one piece is real. Which one piece, mate? Oh, you talking pirates again? Jesus. Bird. What? No, no. Little bump. Got me on.
you bloody weeboo. I'd see I troll here and there, mate. It's a chill Sunday. Yeah, it's the part of the gig. I, I know that no matter what. No matter what personality you have. <laughs> um, yeah, rear tyres are going to be the death of me. I am already slipping and sliding. And I'm driving around fuel map six. Meds. I'm on the, on that minus, oh, I'm gonna go minus five now, but I was minus two. Wasn't doing anything for me. No. Oh. You're alright. I'm slow. Go around. <laughs> but yeah. But now I'm still quicker off Mark 3 here. Just on the break. Yeah, I, I'm, I have to break early as hell, bro. Like, it's it's so sketchy. No, no, no. no. You, it's, it's just through those corners where I make up the time. We just went three seconds faster than what I'm doing. <laughs> what a fucking alien. What a wanker. Get out of the lobby. We don't want you coming around here. Nah, I love you, daddy. I love all my slappers. Especially Ash. He's our, he's our child. Very racy. Very racy. Oh god. This rear end's just fucking doing its own thing, man. Mm, go around. God, I wish you guys could see how much I'm hustling this wheel. Fucking wanging. Holy shit. Get ready to break. Yeah. Get ready to break. Yeah. There's the reason they went so fast. They're in both in Camaro too. <laughs> keep it, keep it. Nearly. There they Meds are cooked, man. No, I take my food there now.
other not a box hugs box again not you about 47 percent I'm 56 I'm good I could get fuel in the second stint but these my tires are cooked I actually think I'd be quicker on I might even yeah I I need to get off these tires look they're right there we still need to grab fuel or somewhat fuel I've got 12 minutes of fuel in the car okay one more we've got we've got 19 19 minutes so we're gonna have to grab like three laps of fuel Yeah, they're flying. Yeah, I don't know, I actually think stay on hearts. Like, just come home on the hearts. Surely they're cooking their meds too. Oh my god. It's like it's <laughs> wet, bro. It's like it's wet. It's this fishy tail. Yeah, I'm gonna grab the fuel. So we need like... Seven laps. Yeah, seven laps of fuel. Whoa, the lights. Whoa. Yeah, that, was nice. that was cool. <laughs> Let there be light. There's rain coming too. 45. Six laps. Seven. Seven. Seven laps. Should have been, we should have been bump drafting earlier, and I didn't have the brake right brake balance to start with. Uh, and I had fucking four seconds. Oh, this is going to be a downpour. That's going to save their tyres if they're not already melted. That's going to help them. But yeah, I think. Because the tie wear again, it's inspired by the Tokyo 600, and we're running around a lot more power than that. Oh, this patch that's about to hit us is going to be so loud. Here it comes now. Moist.
That could be really smart, Simon. Lucy! We just copped it, bro. No, it was hitting us, though. I mean, that was the second lot. Well, I'm on hearts. It's wet enough. Oh, Ferbs is on softs? What? What? What's this fucking cheeky? What's this sorcery? What's this shit? What? Because his car's so good on fuel. He's still got it. Yeah. He's still got to run hard as well. No, he started on them, didn't he? Okay. Yeah, they started on hearts. We started on meds. No, he's on meds now. He's on meds now, cheeky cunt. Fucking <laughs> You fucking Sobs <laughs> Fucking hell mate He's like what about sauce? Shaky shaky man Jesus Christ. Yeah, this, this, this ain't the best choice to drive around here. She's a bit sway.
parts of him. What? How? How? A lot, like the whole race, eight laps. Yeah, they've killed it. No, good on them. They love this place. feel safe to get home. No, damage. No. It's me holding my horn at them. As they go around the fucking hairpin. You're a pack of bums. Fucking cheeky bums. Cheeky top slit strategy. Remember, the real race is an hour, so. So we're doing four minutes later. Yeah, two laps. I'll stop. Actually, no, they've probably got the fuel. But yeah, either way, you can just pull over before you cross the line. Yeah, yeah. That's slow up there. Keep her in company anyway. Yeah, just gonna catch my duck wind. Hards or mediums, aren't you? Come on, hards. Do they still feel like shit? Doing two twelves. The car's just not set up at all. I've just got the mon settings in this. Settings are right like the gearboxes. Yeah, this needs more stretching, it's drinking too much. I've been running fuel map six the whole time.
there's that damage kicking in. Oh, a little bit of draft. I'm gonna get 300. Yep. No, I think 300. My tyres don't look that bad, but they, they yeah, feel like I'm driving around on a wet track. So this one, depending on where you are in your stint, like the rain could really help you. Help look after your tyres. <laughs> I tried, I mean, it's like you parked it and hit your brake and hit your brake and hit your <laughs> Slow down, slow down! <laughs> sorry man! <laughs> <laughs> Dead. <coughs> Look at these slappers, cheeky shits. The only reason I got extra from the kids because I crossed the line. Got the penalty. Nah, because we we're going to cross the line with a lap with time to go, so I just. 180 out of the pits and I reset him. Speed difference. Thing for the 
Shot through, really. Yeah, I, I mean, I just jumped in the Corvette anyways without even trying it. Um, I wouldn't have expected it and wouldn't think that they would last more than fucking two laps. How long did they last? They did like eight laps on them at least. Eight, nine laps. I think one did eight and one did nine. Um, we're racing around Simon, yeah, I feel like they are, and I, yeah, I think they are. I haven't used the Challenger enough, uh, but Simon's using it, and he's faster than me in certain parts, and keeping up with me in others. Yeah, the, the Hellcat to the Challenger, yeah. Big one.
lobby chest, and gonna hit the fart sack, and try and get some Z's. No worries bro, get all better soon, ASAP. I don't know if I'll race again, but I'm gonna definitely test some cars out. Get a setup going. Enjoy the rest of the night handshake. Thanks mate. Um, oh, well, I'm not, but I just don't know if I'll, like, go immediately again, let alone do another half hour, but I'm fine to keep going for a little bit. I just want to test now, try some things. Because, yeah, I'm, I'm, I am pretty tired, but I'm still, like, in the zone and my brain's working overtime now, thinking about fucking the actual race and what to do. I have. I've been like literally physically sore from it. Not the real reason to be sore, but yeah, I mean the, it's paying off. So. Yeah. I know. No. And there's there's more people. We've had we've actually had a, a few randoms come and stay in the Trans Am lobbies too and want to get involved. Just me and Simon then on the mediums, like I, like you could see it in both of us, felt like we were driving on ice. Cars were snapping out, trying to kill us. Just too much rear wear. No worries, bro. Thanks for the race. Yeah, maybe see you some, for some dailies or something tomorrow if I end up doing any. Yeah, yeah. No, no worries, mate. Alright, uh, catch you later. See you, Jimmy. Uphill braking zone and the boss isn't fun.
success does that stand for Super Slapper? Yeah. So This is infinitely better to drive here and faster. Perfect timing for the test. gears to stay off that wall. that one there and just short shifting like all fuck
there's a lot of rain coming. and I turned the car up to fuel map 6, started the lap with 2.8, I was at fuel burn 1 and I turned it up to fuel map 6, it's used 0.3 of a lap, that's mental, just trying to preserve the softs but 5 seconds slower. But yeah, very interesting. So I could see them being used at some point, especially like if you could see a lot of rain coming. Like if you could see a lot of rain coming and timed it well, you could jump on the softs and probably have them stay healthy for a lot longer. If a lot of rain comes down, you can drive out fresh tires on a kind of half wet track. I think you could get, uh, like, and set out to, you know, go as long as you can on fuel. You could get a, um, a really good thing going on, I reckon. Thanks for slap. Yeah, no, it was good, Phibs, and you, um, yeah, you revealed. Nice time. Yeah, oh yeah, the the Corvette was shit, man. Like you should have seen it. Like honestly, go back and watch me and me and Simon driving around our cars, mate, on the mediums. Like five laps in, I'm on the mediums, and I was like, holy fuck! Like just catching the car left, right, and center. Um, and it felt shit on the hards, but the boss felt a lot better then. Instantly, it's the boss. It's Tokyo. Um, but I'm liking it so far. So I've got like. I've got the the charger for the speedway. 
and it's looking also very likely for Grand Valley. And then I've got the Corvette for probably Le Mans and Monza. And then I've got this for Tokyo, by the looks of it, which is good mix. Good, good mix. So can you use softs when we do the ground or just meds and parts? No, you can use softs. They're available. They are there. The requirement is, I genuinely thought, I put them there because, like, we'd qualify on them too. I genuinely thought, good mix. being a one-hour endurance, um, X13, like, I just didn't think they'd last. I didn't think you'd be able to... Because, like, I'm literally inspired by the... It's the same settings as the Tokyo one, and we're at 50 more uh, 50 more PP than what you can enter uh, the Tokyo one in. So the Tokyo, oh no, that's 25, so we're half of that. Oh, okay, then that makes sense too. Then yeah, went half of it. I probably thought that was a bit extreme, and that's pretty much hard only. But still, 13x like all the other races which have still been chewing up the tyres, we're X, for the sprints, we're X7. The Mets were horrible at Tokyo, even hards were better. Yeah, the, the Mets, yeah, they just felt real loose to me. And then, yeah, hards did feel better, but I was deliberately going slower on them too. Uh, I think tomorrow I'm going to finish off my um, grinding during the day so I can buy this car before it disappears again I will have my pretties and then I might even use that and fucking Pete series thing that he wants to do FR only minimum 1000 kilo 1960 to 1980 hard tops shit yeah do it in a Ferrari Nice. I want it, I want it. It's the last Ferrari I need. I want it for ages and I missed it. I should have bought the McLaren last week, but it had I like I've literally got the 14 mil. Had I spent it, I wouldn't have had anything and I would have seen that Ferrari come up and been filthy. So but actually fuck my car's gonna be this charger, if it still doesn't need oil changed, it's the greatest Yeah, oh, finally. Finally. It's had like eighteen races and finally needs an oil change. Some of the other ones, I do like two races in them. They need oil change. But this charge, I swear, maybe it's because it's a new engine, a modern engine. Oh, I like it. It's a bit of a silly livery, but oh, I like it. mean car sick I'm in love with it sounds so good yeah it's starting to look good and you're looking you're looking very good in quite a few of the rounds Ferbs and you got your mix of cars too um we'll see what it's like we'll see um yeah, what Tita does at the speedway, but I think I think you're going to be next to him, the second most competitive person at the speedway. Um, Grand Valley, I mean, I can't believe how well Joken did. Oh, he was in the boss, that's right, in the boss the second time, but even still, first one he did well in Nova, but he loves that place, I love that place. I've been pretty competitive there. I've won a few Monza races, but Artsy looks like he's going to blitz it there in the boss. And I haven't tried the boss at Monza because I just feel it's a bit, you know. Um, and the Corvair is this little C2 that could. So, yeah, it's looking very... It's it's the the bops the best. Like, when people have come into the lobby and they've, like, complained about it and shit without even having one look at it, cracks me up. The bop is really, really solid. I've got to be, yeah, I'm pretty happy with the bolt. I reckon, like I said it the other night, Ferbs, if we, if we loaded up the, um, the Daytona race that we had, yeah, we'll be heaps of fun.
Um, if we loaded up the Daytona race, the settings that we had for Daytona with these exact cars and settings, it would be so competitive. It would be so competitive and so intense. Like I think we'd, we we should look at that in the off time. Like maybe after after the season's done, keep the cars as is. Do Daytona with those exact same settings, no OP. Um, Trans Am and no OP. GT40. Still keep the draft thing going on. I think it could be so good with these big fat cars going around. So yeah, but it's gonna be good. I'm keen. I've been trying not to um. With these cars with no backing trans <laughs> yeah, no shit. Trans life matters. Yeah, it, it, it upset a few. Put a put a spanner in it. That's for sure. But I think it's it's the best it's ever been right now. So it was for the greater good. Let us iron out some more kinks. Um. Anyway, suits. So I'm. Well, yeah. We'll see how the dailies are tomorrow. Um. But I will try and keep the momentum going with the subs and stuff and do some slapping from the back. Um, if it is, if it's group two, like a thousand percent, I'm going to be on my other account buying a fucking GT1 and slapping in Watkins Glen in the group two car, 100%. Um, but even if it's group, what what was this week's race there? Yeah, group two. So yeah, even if it's group four, I'll do it. Whatever it is, it's Watkins Glen, I'll do it. You know I like Watkins, I'll do it. So I'll do that tomorrow night. From the back, slappers. We'll try and play nice. But yeah, have a good night, guys. Thanks for watching. Sorry it's not an OBS stream, but it's just better when I'm in a party with the lads sometimes. Much more comfortable, not as hectic. I'll speak to you soon.